is Full Game Prometheus giving you another full game recap. Uh, rolling with the uh, the Raiders playbook on offense and defense, and this is actually going to be draft champions. I know I haven't done this in a while, but I want to give you guys some draft champions, and it's one of the reasons why I'm using the Raiders is because it was the, uh, the, uh, the playbook that I picked up. Uh, this is going to be a little strategy I'm going to use in defense which is going to be using Engage 8 uh, on the first couple of plays. I actually picked this this technique up against a player that I beat online, and um, it really changed how I run my offense. And I'll tell you that in this particular game, this, this defensive strategy actually worked out pretty well for me uh, because I put him in a situation where he's a third and 22, down his own territory I come with about a seven man blitz right here and actually pressure comes in and I'm able to go ahead and get him down fourth and 30 should be punting the ball uh, this is a this is a really stupid move right here I think I just jumped into I ran into another blitz right here and I've got a cover two shell over top and he actually just throws the ball up two defenders there to go and play that and I, I guess the ball down to the five yard line so Feeling pretty good about myself right here. Do a nice little inside zone right here. Uh, no huddle into um, <clears throat> a little drag uh, routes right here, and then actually hit him in the backside. So uh, second uh, second possession here, I jump and show him kind of the same look, but this time I go into cover three. He takes a shot right up the middle of the field, and I'm able to go ahead and, and swap that ball away. Now I go into a different type of coverage. I think it's a, another variation of a cover three right here. I've got a lot of action going off the left-hand side. He takes another shot up the field, and actually my defensive back was out of position. That was a good play right there. So uh, going to cover two shell, I've got a blitz going off the edge. I go ahead and hover over the gap. This is uh, cover two over, um, and he's actually in a, in a heavy formation. So uh, right here, the pressure comes off, but he throws it right into a flat defender. The flat defender tackles him for a six-yard gain. I go back into like a heavy blitz. He's, I think he's got a Bettis card, and he actually just barrels ahead and actually picks up some yards. Now I go into a um, basically a man blitz, and I get a, an A gap and, a, and a, a blitz off the edge. Fourth and six, he no huddles again. So I figured just go with the man blitz again uh, and try to cover him right over the middle. And I get a nice little SWAT animation to go ahead and get him off the field again. So up 7 to nothing. I've got the ball. I go with the draw play right here. He actually sends the dogs after me. I get a nice little animation right here. Break a couple tackles and fall forward. So uh, go into a Salem out of the uh, trips, uh, single back trips. And I actually hit the crosser route right over the middle and actually get a bad animation. I think I pulled down on the turbo button a little bit too early. So now I go ahead and jump into the out and up. And I've got basically a couple flat routes and then I've got a deep post route. Uh, the flat route was open, so I just dump it down. I just want to go ahead and make sure that my opponent has to be conscious of the underneath stuff so I can start opening things up top. Go into a draw play right here. Got got pretty good animation, but he gets he gets a nice little block shadow off my center. Uh, third to four situation, I jump into um, uh, basically a angle smash, and I've got the slant run on the backside, but my wide receiver does not hold in the ball. So fourth and four, I'm just feeling like I really I'm in mean, control of this game. So uh, typically I'd actually pump the ball off, but I go ahead and try to check it down to the running back. He gets a nice little animation with his defensive player and actually swats the ball out. So now he's got the ball. Um, I've got uh, basically, you know, he's got a stack line right there. He's, I think he's got several linemen, a couple tight ends and stuff like that. I feel like he's going to run the ball off the edge, so I go and shift my line around a little bit. And right here, actually, he's got two two defenders. He throws right into into my defensive player right there. And I'm able to go and pick him off, and that's it. He quits out. So real fast game on, on, sale, on draft champions. I'll show you some more gameplay with that. But I want to show you a bonus game. This is uh, another game that uh, I got uh, playing with the, uh, against the Philadelphia Eagles. I've been using the Chargers online, just as a little change of pace. It's nice to have, nice to have, have a, uh, a nice elite quarterback because they make a lot of reads. They, they, they make better throws, and they can get rid of the ball a little bit better. So it's an out-and-up play right here. I've got the one-on-one -on -one coverage I'm looking for, but his defensive back comes out and plays that ball perfectly uh, against my wide receiver. So now I come back. Um, I'm using... Uh, curls out of that Raider split back formation and I've got the deep comeback route right here so I just go and pop this and I get a little possession catch because I wanted to get the first down so first and ten situation right here on the 40 yard line go back to the out and up uh, uh, I see a couple defenders floating up I've got some routes going over the middle and I've got one over the top so Allen's able to go and get me down to the 35 yard line 
to go back to curls and right here you can see there's nobody in the area of my, my slot receiver Allen being able to go and get a nice little first uh, a touchdown against him. So up seven to nothing with three minutes left to, in the first quarter. It's been a very fast drive. He does a mesh concept against me and actually picks up the running back underneath. So I've seen a lot of guys using this online um, and those the, those wheel routes are really effective. I come into a cover two look. It looks like I'm showing him cover four. I go with some pressure, and I've got my flat defender that actually comes down and picks that ball off. He thinks that he thinks that flat is open, but it really wasn't. So I actually get a nice little interception and be able to go and pick him off. So now I come into uh, this is a double post out of the out of the, out of this Raider playbook, and that route right there is money, man. You can you can hit that with any uh, majority of the zones out there. It just gets underneath it. Jump into a uh, screen and then jump right back into curls, back into uh, into the the draw play right here. And pick up some good yards. Now, uh, this is probably, I think this is a bad a bad move by me. Um, I'm looking at the deep comeback route, but this is in the red zone, and the defenders, defense should back should fall back a little bit further. So that's not a good play to be using in the red zone, and I was just, I was a little bit cocky. I just, I just felt like I had the momentum of my game, and I was trying to squeeze something in, and that was just a bad choice. It's something I'll never do again with this, with this Raiders playbook. So he takes off this quarterback and actually throws the ball over top my defenders and gets the ball into the end zone to go to get the score tied at seven to seven. So. I do a little draw play right there, pick up an easy first down, go back to uh, deep curls, and I'm going to be looking for Allen. Um, the defender floats up with Allen, so I look at the comeback route, but look, he actually picks that up. So I don't know what happened with that trade off, but I had to get rid of the ball, and I did, I get, I did throw it away. Go back into the out and up right here, actually, no, uh, into the double post. Wheel up my uh, tight end, block my running back, and do a little drag route underneath. Actually, no, I left the, uh, left the route, but you could see the post was why it was not open. I actually got away with runner there. I threw right in the coverage. Right here, I jump into the bubble screen. This is a nice little play. I uh, actually will get a, a, a receiver wide open. I drop it down to the bubble. And you can see I picked up 10 yards on a bubble route. It's just such a weird, fluky little play. Go into a draw play right here. And um, I got a nice little blocking situation. I actually pick up uh, four yards on that. So I'll take four yards on a run play. Go back into uh, the curls. Uh, I've got the, the curl routes. I've got the little crossing route. I drop it down to the running back route and get a nice little twist right there to go and pick it up. I pick up first down. Once again, deep curls, got this this queued up. I'm looking for the underneath routes uh, because I'm thinking he might be blitzing. And you can see right here the running back route is wide open. The defender's actually floated up. And I go check it down and get five yards. So I'm just getting a little bit closer to the red zone right now. I'm thinking about the, uh, actually, right here I jump into a different place. So the, the clock is ticking down. Five seconds, four seconds, three seconds. So calm, calm, calm. Go ahead and look for the running back route, and I check it down to a little crosser. Get a nice little animation to go ahead and get the ball down to the four-yard line to get a first down. So jump into an inside zone is my base play. This is uh, the, the, the uh the wing type situation and I actually just go ahead and fall right into the red zone to go up by 14 to 7 so he's got the ball down to the 20 yard line I go into uh, basically a 43 look once again he's actually taking a, taking a look at that running back route so my defenders actually play that running back route so he went back to the well on that now I switch things up a little bit I go into um, basically uh, the uh, over G deep type defense right here and I get a, a block shed and actually another guy comes up and and, and stops his quarterback for a, a like gainer so third and fourth situation I have a uh, dual blitz set up here with man blitz and I actually have to cover Jeffries. He throws to my user, and I get one of the rare instances of an actual play against him. So going to mid-blitz right here, uh, I just figured I need to get this guy uh, out of the game. And um, I go ahead and, and cover up uh, Sproles. And right here, uh, he actually picks it up perfectly, but I get a good animation against his uh, tight end, and actually the ball just pops right out right there. So he quits out. That's it. So once again, guys, this is uh, the Raiders playbook. I hope you guys pick up some uh, tips from, from me, my gameplay. And until next time.